Hi, good morning everyone. Let's get started with our next topic which is on factors affecting the complexity of an SAP upgrade. So in this particular topic, we'll talk about the different factors which affect the complexity of an upgrade. So one key thing is the IT related complexity drivers, which are application landscape, number of application landscape which are affected. SAP Upgrade Dependency Analyzer helps to analyze the information if the two landscape in question are compatible or will be supported by SAP after upgrade of one system. So basically this is one key thing when we are performing an SAP upgrade we need to review and see whether the dependent component whether they will be impacted or not. Say for example if I am performing an upgrade of a ECC system whether my BW system will be impacted or not, whether my portal will be impacted or not and vice versa. Unicode conversion, if the client is using MDMP then it has to undergo Unicode conversion. Project strategy can be decided depending on the client version. If the system is running on say 4.6 CB or below then twin upgrade followed by Unicode conversion is required. Or if the system is on 4.7 or above then Unicode upgrade can be carried out before the upgrade. So these are basically some of the factors which are IT related factors. Then the complexity of the landscape, the way in which landscape is organized will ascertain the time required for upgrade. A typical SAP landscape is say dev to QA to prod as suggested by SAP is considered to be less complex. Source release, source release below 4.6c requires more effect even two step upgrade. System on 4.6c and above involves less risk as it introduces less changes to the ECC system. Usage of the add-ons. Inclusion of non-SAP add-ons adds to the complexity and the availability with these each of the vendors should be checked to see add-ons are compatible with ECC. So we need to review each add-ons in the system and make sure that they are compatible with the new release. Front-end software, SAP GUI should also be upgraded independently of the technical upgrade. Okay, next is the project related complexity drivers. So project related complexity drivers are mainly the upgrade strategy that is SAP recommends to perform technical upgrade before the functional and strategic upgrade. Parallel projects, the number of development should be minimized while doing an upgrade. The production system transport should be set up that it can be maintained throughout the upgrade project so that the important and urgent transports can be carried out. Customer Test cases and documentation needs to be taken care of. Also, team needs to be prepared for the upgrade. Okay, then business related complexity drivers. Business situation. General business driver to cause the project delays like global recession, business mergers, etc. Business requirement. New functionalities, downtime restrictions need to be taken care of in case of deciding the project. That's all I wanted to cover in this particular training session. Thank you for joining and have a nice day. Bye-bye.